Hello, welcome to uh, the presentation on Masters in Business Analytics at Trinity Business School. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank you for your interest in this master's program. Business analytics is one of the fastest growing fields of uh, in the world of business. And MSc in Business Analytics is a new program that has been launched by uh, Trinity College Dublin's Trinity Business School in the year 2021-22. Uh, just to give you a brief background of the school and the university, I'm sure you already know most of these facts. Trinity College Dublin is the highest ranked university in Ireland and, and it is constantly ranked amongst one of the top 100 or so universities in the world. Within Europe, it has it is always ranked as number one in uh, for entrepreneurship. We are a huge university with 18,258 students uh, uh, 18 to 20,000 students in and 170 sports club and student societies. As for the business school, we are the number one business school in Ireland and amongst top 20 in uh, the Western Europe. Trinity Business School has long history. Uh, we were founded in 1925 and we have about 2,700 students as of today. We have partnerships with uh, schools and universities all across the world. Uh, we have over 50 exchange partners uh, in, in across different parts of the world. Why you should choose Trinity Business School for your master's program? I would say it would be because of the TBS DNA. Uh, we are a school that is focused on educating uh, our students for business performance. It's not knowledge of theory, it's knowledge of practice, how to take knowledge, go out and implement that in the world of business. Uh, we have a lot of real business education environment and all, all our programs are influenced and der derive on the high quality research that our faculty members participate in. Moving specifically, now we'll talk about the business analytics program. As I said, MSc in business analytics is being launched in 2021 uh, for academic session. It is one of the it's, it's one of the most important programs in the world of business as of today, as I've started out already. Now, based on our own experience, we have designed this program uh, after due consultation with people in industry, people in uh, different parts of academia across the world. And this program reflects best of what business requires and best of what academia has to offer. The first question uh, that might that, that you might have is who is this program for and uh, what will you gain from this program? This program is a, is what we call a semi-technical program. There's not purely technical program. Uh, there are a lot of uh, data science programs that are offered by uh, departments of computing and computer science. Trinity, uh, Trinity College Dublin's School of Computer Science offers a master's in uh, computer science with specialization in data science. This is not a technical program. This is a semi-technical program where you would learn the skills of how to implement those technical artifacts, those algorithms for business case in business world. What, which algorithm to use and how to interpret those results for a business advantage uh, in whatever field you work. That is, that is what we are looking for. That's why we say it's a semi-technical program. The program has a very well thought out mix between Technical modules uh, where we'll teach you stuff like data mining and, uh, and machine learning, as well as applied modules like marketing analytics and financial analytics. The way we see it, it will be best suitable for students with numerate background who are interested in the field of management and business. When we say numerate background, we mean students who have some exposure to the world of uh, numbers and computing. Uh, we do not mean MSc in mathematics or BSc in mathematics. No, no of, of course not. Uh, you can have any background, uh, uh, like bachelor's, bachelor's in business, bachelor's in global business, bachelor's in commerce, finance. You can come from a background in engineering. As of now, uh, I'm happy to tell you that admissions are going on, and uh, we typically we typically get people from across 15, 20 different uh, specializations. So, yeah, it is. 
it is great uh, uh, it is it would be great if you have a uh, relevant uh, technical background but even if you don't have a relevant technical background that's not a problem uh, we will cover uh, techn technical aspects during the program all we ask is an aptitude for numbers and an aptitude for analytics that's that, that's all that's all we have. this program does not expect any prior background in programming or any prior background in uh, in analytics if you have that good uh, if you don't have that not to worry we'll I will build on uh, for that during the course of this program what will you learn what will this program teach you will teach you uh, apart from the technical aspects uh, of uh, analytics apart from the applied aspect of analytics also teach you the strategic aspect of analytics how to implement analytics projects many firms are increasingly using analytics in different uh, divisions from supply chain to human resources to consumer analytics you will also learn how to implement analytics projects how to manage those projects through various frameworks another aspect uh, that is of rising importance in the world of data and analytics is uh, the debate around privacy the debate around global legislations uh, debate around gdpr in this module we have a very high focus and that is driven by the trinity's dna we have high focus on the ethical and privacy issues uh, you will deal with what are the GDPR implications in the world of analytics. You'll also learn the ethical issues related to analytics, which may not uh, be legislated upon currently. But um, as future managers, we believe our students uh, would do well to understand and learn and uh, be ethical managers handling data ethically. Another aspect is at the end of uh, the two semesters, uh, we do have an option for students to engage in industry project. So you can do either an industry project or a classical dissertation on topic of your choice. We have both pathways open for our students. Just to discuss the learning journey that you would have at uh, Trinity Business School in MSN Business Analytics, the program is divided into three semesters. The first semester runs from September to December. The second semester runs from January to April and the third one from May to August. What you can see are the names of these uh, semesters, as we call them in Trinity, Michaelmas, Hillary, and Trinity terms. In the first uh, semester, uh, from September to December, uh, you will be taught fundamental modules of business analytics. We will use this semester to basically bring you up to date on the foundations of analytics that are required in terms of programming, in terms of tools, techniques, etc. For instance, uh, you will see in first uh, term, course on foundations of business analytics, which will cover the fundamental statistics uh, that are essential. The second module is data management and visualization. Data visualization is the is currently the most important way of handling data. 80% of analytics is done just through graphs and visualization. So this module will introduce you how to handle data in various kinds of databases and how to use visualization tools to convey your uh, story without doing any of the hard numeric analytics. The third and fourth modules that you see here called business data mining and business forecasting. Now these modules would uh, take you to the details of analytic techniques. You will cover machine learning, you will cover data mining, uh, you will cover different kinds of uh, supervised and unsupervised algorithms in these two modules. The next module that you see here is strategy for analytics. Here we take a much more managerial approach. Uh, through this module, uh, you will learn how to handle analytics projects, how to look at analytics management, how to look at uh, issues when uh, issues and challenges related to change management in firms. The final module in uh, first semester is ethical and privacy issues in business data. As we discussed, this is a module that is uh, very essential uh, for all managers to know, learn for successful business navigation in today's uh, age. Based on the fundamentals that you would have covered in first semester, we move into second semester into more applied and high level modules. So you can, as you can see in second semester, what you have is business decision optimization, where you learn how to optimize dif uh, different aspects of business, operation research, that's what will be covered. Uh, the next three modules, uh, marketing analytics, financial modeling and analysis, operation analytics are applied models where we will introduce you to different aspects of analytics and the way they uh, deal with uh, different business functional domains of marketing, finance and operations. After that, we have social media analysis. 
Now, this is a growing area of research uh, where uh, we will deal with how to handle social media data, what are different aspects. Uh, you'll also learn sentiment mining, emotion mining, making decisions based on available social media information. Final module uh, in your second semester is going to be big data and AI in business that will prepare you for the changes uh, led by artificial intelligence that is going to uh, impact the business world in the coming years. The final semester is dedicated to industry project or dissertation. All students will have a choice to engage in either a dissertation or an industry project of their choice. Uh, we, uh, we have strong relationship with various firms across, across uh, the board and you can make use of them to work with industry or you can pick up a problem of your choice and work with our leading faculty members to deep dive and develop your skills in a specific technique. Both these options will be open. Now, what are the key pointers in, in our business analytics program? As you saw, as you just saw, our business analytics program has a very delicate balance between the technical and applied modules. It's not a purely technical course and it's not a purely applied, uh, purely managerial course. Uh, you will learn uh, the basics of technology and you will also learn how to implement them, uh, implement them in business context. Uh, throughout the uh, module, you will gain skills and you will be trained in multiple softwares like R. R is going to the lingua franca of this program. Uh, for visualization, we'll also introduce you to Tableau. Uh, you will also learn all these techniques in Python through our tutorial sessions. Marketing analytics will be through SPSS. You will also learn uh, SQL. We will also introduce you to NoSQL techniques as well. Uh, throughout this module, uh, throughout the, all these courses, you will have a high level of interaction with Dublin-based analytics industry. As you know, Dublin is the hotbed of uh, technology in Europe. It's the European headquarters for almost all technology firms. And we are fortunate to be located in such a great city. And we have great relationship with most of these companies. MSN Business Analytics is closely aligned with Analytics Institute of Ireland, with whom we have uh, we are developing a, a very great relationship. Uh, uh, they will be happy to certify our students as well in future. Uh, and the fact is you have a great mix of faculty members with cutting edge research and industry experience. Our faculty members are some of the best in the world in uh, in terms of the research in uh, different aspects of social media analytics in terms of analytics strategy. And one of our faculty members, I'll introduce you, has even developed their own packages that are uh, a part of our uh, software development sessions. So we do have one of the best people uh, to teach and that we've implemented with the visiting faculty members from across the industry domain of uh, Dublin City. This is just to give you a brief idea of who all will be involved with this program. Uh, Professor John Dong is the chair of business is the chair of business analytics at Trinity Business School. He has a long history in uh, research and uh, industry consulting in the form of in the area of analytics. He works in analytics strategy, social media analysis. Professor Yu Fei Wang, associate professor in operations management. Uh, he will be he might, he'll be taking modules on statistics and optimization. He's he's uh, one of the leading researchers in the domain of operations management. Professor Nicholas Danks is assistant professor in business analytics. He has a background in statistics and uh, analytics. Uh, he works in R and has developed multiple packages that are part of uh, our development suite. Professor Maximilian Schaumeyer is assistant professor in business ethics. He has research interests at the intersection of technology and ethics and is one of the best people in the world to train you on GDPR and ethical issues in business data. As for myself, uh, who is Taking you through this session, I'm Ashish Kumaja. I am the program director of MSN Business Analytics. I have designed and developed this program based on my own past experience of having managed and developed business analytics program in France and India before moving to Ireland. My interests are in the area of social media analysis, and that's where I, you will see me a lot more after, if you join the program. Now. Business analytics programs is, as I said, is very new. However, we do have a strong relationship with industries around uh, around, uh, around in Dublin and across the world. Our graduates from all the programs uh, find spaces in all leading firms of uh, Dublin. As you can see, these are all the companies that have traditionally hired uh, our graduates. And this is just the opening. Uh, you'll find our graduates are already in high demand. We are already in discussion with firms like Novartis to take our future graduates in, in this domain. Just to give you a brief of where we are located, 
uh, for those of you who are not from Dublin, this is an aerial view of Dublin. What you see in green is Trinity College Dublin. And as you can uh, look around, we are surrounded uh, by the European headquarters of some of the leading technology firms of the world. And this enables us to interact, uh, interact with them in a very uh, in a very regular and dedicated manner uh, as many of these people from these industries support us uh, they visit us they support us uh, through our lectures and through hiring our students and this also provides opportunity for our students to engage with them in a much uh, in a much richer fashion for their internships for their job placements etc now these are the details uh, for the program uh, if you'd like to encourage you uh, to read about read more about us uh, at our MSc blogs and visit our MSc website, please follow us on social media. If you have any queries or concerns about the program, please feel free to write to us at business.masters at tcd.ie. We'll be happy to happy to answer any of your queries related to admissions, about the program, the future, job opportunities, whatever they may be, we'll be happy to do that. Thanks for your interest. Thanks for listening uh, to this presentation. And we hope you would apply for MSN Business Analytics and be a part of the changing nature of the business in future. Thank you.